All right, so let's go through the gift center again. We already covered all that plenty of times. The one thing we need to cover a little bit more is the actual center gift center. We covered the aisles, covered the individual tool tests over there. So, all right, again, 249 for the two tool combo kit. You got the hammer, the mid-range hammer drill and variable trigger impact driver. Two four and power batteries, charger in a bag for 249. That is right there. A decent hammer drill, you guys, and a decent impact driver. Well worth the purchase. $14.88 for a kneeling pad, which I keep saying I need to get one of these. $149 was $179 for the three-ton low-profile floor jack. I glad I got the the three-ton. Uh, glad I got the one that I got. $29.98 uh, for the three-ton jack stand set. It comes with two of them. So that's not a bad price, you guys, for those. $16.88 for their 20 ounce steel uh, rip claw and a hammer, 15 inch, and the wrecking bar. If you needed both of those tools, there you go for $16.88. These are great gifts, you guys. These are great stuff, stuffing stockers, st stocking stuffers. So that's the same thing. $14.88 for two 25 foot Husky tape measures. Could always use tape measures, you guys. Get in there, got it. Fourteen ninety seven. You get the two piece groove, uh, groove point. Uh, sorry, groove joint plier set. It's a good size. Uh, one is twelve inch, and the other one is ten inch. Or twelve ninety seven. You can get the six in one multifunctional pliers. So that's not bad. That's not a bad deal, you guys. Wire cutters as well. $13.97, you get the three-piece adjust adjustable wrench set. Which I need to pick that up. Or you can get the three-piece locking plier set. I want to get another one of those. $14.97, you get the two-piece groove joint set. Oh, same thing, same thing. Already been through that. All right, for 179, you get the 290 piece mechanical tool set, quarter inch, three eighths, and half inch drives. That's not a bad deal, you guys. Hard case with drawers. That's not a bad deal at all. 179 for all this. It's a good kit. So pick that up if you need a, a lot of sockets. These are not impact rated, these are regular, uh, uh, regular standard sockets. It does come with deep and short. It comes with some Allen bits and an Allen keys, or non uh, wrenches, but non adjustable. Adjustable. So that's that's a nice kit to have, you guys. Or for forty nine ninety seven, you get the ninety four piece mechanical tool set. For nineteen ninety seven, you get the forty six piece stubby tool set. It'll be good to just keep in your car, or if you need uh, just a few sockets, you know, it's a good, good stocking stuffer right there. Not a bad price either. Now I do own this torque, uh, this torque bar, this torque wrench. It is actually a nice tool to have, especially if you want to put your lugs to uh, specs. That so you can get that the half inch torque uh, wrench for fifty nine ninety seven, or you can get the three eighths inch torque wrench for forty nine ninety seven. And the one, the this one goes to two hundred fifty foot pounds, and this one goes to one hundred foot pounds. $29.97 for the three-piece pry bar set. Husky is a good brand, you guys. They really are. They make good enough tools at a good price. Are there better products out there? Yes, but there's also worse products out there. So Husky actually is a good brand. $24.97, you get the 36-inch pry bar. Remember, that's a three-piece set. $34.97, you can get the 11-piece half-inch deep drive uh, impact-rated socket set. That is right there. It goes from uh, 13, 14, 13, all the way to, all right, so it has 13 millimeter, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, and 22. Why 20 is not in there is beyond me, but 20 millimeter should be in there. 20 millimeter comes in a lot. It comes in handy pretty often. 2497, you get the 19 piece extension adapter set. You always need adapters. Adapters are fantastic to have. 12-point ratcheting box end, 24-piece ratcheting wrench set. 
That is $59.88. That actually went down in price. I like that. Not bad, you guys. I got this. I got this set. This set's fantastic. It's hanging up on the wall right now, and I use this all the time for my mechanical work. Hundred dollars, you can get the sander for uh, from Makita, or you can get for one seventy nine. You can get the uh, single hand reciprocating saw, jigsaw, X lock grinder. This is the four and a half to five inch, and for twenty four ninety seven, you, you can get the turbo rim or the continuous rim. Not a bad price, you guys. Now for X lock, that's I, I love the X lock technology, which Bosch actually uh, I think. It, Bosch invented that and Makita adopted it. So that's all that. 259, you can get two five amp hour batteries and you can get a, an additional free two more five amp hour batteries. Rear style, uh, rear worm style drive, uh, seven and a quarter inch circular saw with a bag and a dual charger. It's not bad. See, that's a great deal. Four or five amp hour batteries, you're good. I, you know, when it comes to this kit, it is a good drill driver, good impact driver, but I seriously, both of these are atomic, but the DCF 850 is actually a better uh, impact driver. So that is my favorite impact driver of all time. Uh, right now, so I love that impact driver. It's a fantastic tool and it's very small. It's very compact and it is extremely powerful Yeah, it would it would have been nice if the DCF 850 was in this kit just for like an extra uh, Deal for everyone to have like I love that impact driver But you can get this tool tool two tool combo kit for 149 Was 229 you can get for ranging from six dollars to uh ten dollars you can get some dewalt bits like i said you guys don't buy ryobi bits because they actually cost the same as milwaukee or dewalt ryobi bits are actually terrible and for the same price you can actually get a very high quality bit so that kit is 150 for the two tools you can get two batteries charging a bag, and I think these are 1.5 amp hours or two amp hours, but they're black. So I think those are the standard 1.5 amp hour batteries, but not bad. This is a compact, uh, compact atomic drill driver is actually amazing for what it is. And I, I, uh, I love it. That atomic, uh, this version of the atomic impact driver is all right, but it's variable trigger only. I still say the DCF 850 should have been in this kit just to make add a little pizzazz to it. Not too shabby though. For 129, you can get either of these, these atomics, a single handed reciprocating saw, or the four and a half inch circular saw. You can get the the brushless. Uh, it's non XR uh, multi tool for the four amp hour battery and a charger. <coughs> Two forty nine for the eighteen gauge Brad nailer. Oh, it's Go over here. Where is it? It's actually awesome and I seriously want it. Come on, where's, there it is. All right, so they do have this DeWalt pin nailer over here. This is 300 as a kit. And so it's nice. This is a 23 gauge. And uh, and yeah, it would be nice if this was the size of the 18 gauge brand nailer. Uh, uh, DeWalt Atomic, uh, please make this, make this size of an 18 gauge brand nail. Uh, nailer like it would be a fantastic idea it would sell extremely well because the xr stuff is actually big and bulky and to have like a, a regular 18 gauge brand nailer would be awesome in this size like i supported the atomic line since the beginning since their first couple of tools when dewalt xr fans hated it they hated the atomic line because they said it was garbage, it was weak. How dare DeWalt make that? But I've been a DeWalt, uh, atomic fan since the beginning because I saw the potential of what they could actually do. And look at that. Like, it's a beautiful tool. I do have videos coming up. I thank you guys so much for tuning in and subscribing to the channel and watching these uh, tool sale walkthroughs. I hope that you get motivated to get into tools if you're not into tools already. You know, and start learning how to do stuff yourself because we need, we do need more people 
in the construction business with people knowing how and how to do the basic stuff for household work. You don't need to hire a contractor for everything. So I'm hoping that some people get motivated for that. So that's pretty much it. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. Happy holidays, you guys. And I hope you, all you guys have a good, safe uh, Thanksgiving. And if you got to travel far, please drive safe. I'll see you guys next time. I love you guys. I thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. And happy holidays.